there. We wanted to go to bed like immediate, like sleep. It was eight o'clock at night. We got up at midnight and it was rocking, and we went out and I mean, it was and amazing. People were nice. We said, yeah, oh yeah, but I did get pickpocketed. You did, but everybody told me I was well, going you get to. Pickpocketed so in the yeah. US too, don't you? Yeah, yeah, not, yeah. not that I've in never New been pickpocketed. City. New York City, probably. Maybe. But I got pickpocketed in San Jose one time. Really? 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 Tonight <laughs> on stage. Let's yeah. talk about that. Yeah, yeah really. Yeah. So Let's. I got right. raped on stage. All right. <laughs> so you all, well, I got you, molested. You on stage, picked sorry. her. I've My seen goodness. you a few times. I've seen you a few times. You when you do hero, you bring a girl up on stage. Not all the time. Sometimes. You never bring a guy ever. Seven sieges. Except in Sitges, right. or G-A-Y. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've been there too, yeah. Of course you've been <laughs> So, everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why you, you think I've been to, the to these gay spots. places. <laughs> <laughs> no, he, he knows where he's loved. Uh, who, I, that's a huge thing. That's a huge crowd. Cool. So, did you br- bring a guy up on stage there? I actually did. And? I actually did. Did you touch uh, him like you touched Jennifer tonight? Uh... <laughs> Kind of touched me a little bit. Oh, I believe yeah. it. So yeah, he wasn't as drunk as Jennifer. Okay, uh, so we I talked to the girl after. Drunk, we huh? talked to this girl after she got off stage. Yeah. And she was loaded, like loaded, drunk, wasted. Did think that? Because we she asked her. Talk. She <laughs> said yes. She says, "Oh hell yeah, I'm drunk." Yeah. Now you she was having fun, which is cool. Dude, she I was. think when you come to a show, you gotta have. Fun. Are you but sometimes just not in the mood to do that, like to pull somebody out of the audience? It depends. If I'm not in a good mood, I won't do it. If yeah. I'm in a good mood, you know what I love about it? That you never know who you're gonna pull up on stage. Like <laughs> Have you, you can pull yeah. up the pull most the random, craziest people. <laughs> yeah, somebody with a gun. Exactly. <laughs> but you talked to her like she was a dog. That you're like, stay, stay. No, <laughs> because that's because she was a little drunk. Yeah. So you know what? I was afraid she was gonna fall. Can you imagine well, she falls off the stage? You're gonna. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 uh, yeah. That we don't have the insurance for that. Don't do that. There's one point that you reached out your hand and she They're not gonna sue me. <laughs> they're, they're gonna sue people because after all these girls see you on stage, this whole floor is wet. <laughs> Are you allowed to say that on the radio? Can you Probably say that? Probably not. And I'm gay. I can do whatever I want. <laughs> oh, okay. Gay people can do a lot of things. We've been discriminated a lot against, so they let us pack. <laughs> <laughs> it's reparations. <laughs> yeah, to the gays. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I have. I do have a question. You've probably if I been said asked, that, I'd you? be in trouble. Oh uh, no, you can do whatever. Uh, look at you. you get yeah, mobbed. Really? They ever? Uh, does that ever get tiring? People like touching you and it feeling doesn't. you. And you know what? I've been doing this for so many years, and it doesn't. I, I feel like. I don't know. I, I don't know why I feel like I, every day I wake up, and this is the honest truth. I feel like it. You know, I want to make the most out of it. If it, what if it ever goes away? What if I'm in a restaurant and nobody comes up for an autograph? What if I turn on the radio and I don't hear one of my songs? What if I, you know, you know, it can, you know, yeah. It's, yeah. what comes up, what comes up. What if you look in the mirror down. and you're not gorgeous? Just that that, never that day, that day, you know. <laughs> trust me, if you saw me, if you saw me drunk, 4 a.m. Completely naked. I would take advantage in of front you. Of, no, <laughs> you would? Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, you got pretty bad. <laughs> I would love to see you <laughs> drunk. What, why would you bring that up? Naked for you. Yeah, I know. Maybe I shouldn't uh, bring that up. You know what? I don't have to do the show tomorrow morning. Uh, let's try it. Let's see what happens. <laughs> You're just doing out the red meat. You need to be careful. All right, this is totally not a sexual question, but I want to know if you did this or not. You've got to be asked a million times since the World Cup. Did Nasty you or did naked. you not? Did you? I'm a man of word. Of course I did. So you did it. I did. So they really tell you not to? I wanted to make sure it was foggy. Right. Um, it was dark. Nobody dark. Did, did they really tell you not to? Like, where they weren't going to Nobody would tell me not to. They had a Oh, no, they did. Report. Actually, did. But that's not me. Actually, they called... I don't know the authorities. I guess they, it's indecent exposure, so you're not allowed to do it technically. In Miami, they do everything <laughs> yeah. else there. You can't take your clothes have off. You, have you been ski? to Miami? I've of been, course, yes, you of have course. been to Miami. <laughs> <laughs> Where do you think I went to Miami? Of course. <laughs> you know <laughs> what? When I was in Miami, I kissed the ugliest guy I've ever kissed. So that it's not really true. There's not all the hot guys there. There is. I found the ugliest guy. Do they know the ugliest? Yeah, guy you ever? do. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, really. I mean, a city that big, you think he'd, he'd find at least one cute one? I was drunk. <laughs> 4 a.m. I was naked. You know what they say after 4 a.m. Why? Especially if you're drunk. Never mind. Can I can't say. No, I can't say. You can say that. <laughs> so I just read that. Um, Anna. Hey, don't get me going. Anna's guys. got an engagement ring. Yes. Yeah, I just read that. No. Did you give not. it to her? Well, somebody gave her a ring. You need to get <laughs> yeah, all that. Yeah, he's like, find out. That wasn't me. <laughs> I'm serious. You, you better find out. I am gonna find out. No, so. no, I'm not. I'm not married. No, I'm not getting. Are you not? You're not getting married. No, we're cool. Oh, that's great news. No, but you. Without having to get married. Like yeah, yeah, you can. What is it? Like ring? ring we're talking about. Before, come on. Listen, yeah. I'm and gonna you. just get my man's uh, name tattooed right here. Enrique. What's your man's name? Enrique. Enrique. No, Enrique Derek, what? Derek. 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 Yeah, Derek. <laughs> Where is he from? Uh, he is from originally yeah. Alaska. Alaska. Yeah. Ooh, don't say anything cold, about Sarah huh? Palin. I don't want to hear about like <laughs> yeah, he's cold. cold. Yeah. <laughs> it's always like a, it's cold. It's drunk. Uh, <laughs> that again. How long have you been with him? Two years. Two years. Man, you're better interviewer than I am. 
For me, yeah. oh my God, for a gay man, two years is like 20 years. Is it? Yes. Okay. But you lie about your relationship all the time. I do all the time, absolutely. Yeah, that's yeah. in Wikipedia. What's the latest lie? Just so you know. I do. <laughs> What's the latest lie? I don't know. I like lying about it because I hate people knowing about my personal life. Yeah. I mean, I don't mind it to a certain degree, but when it... It's right. really, really, really personal. I don't know. I feel like for some reason I want to go home and I want to make sure that I don't open up my laptop and, and read about my personal life or, or pick up a Don't magazine. read my blog then. I'm just well, kidding. I, I can blog. imagine. I don't even have one. <laughs> yeah, you do have a blog. Of I course do not. You do. Who wants to blog? Well, yeah, a lot of people want to blog. Uh, well, he wants us to ask you about your music. Oh. <laughs> oh we don't care. About my music. He's the music guy. <laughs> Nobody um, cares about that. <laughs> yeah. So, Enrique, um, tell, uh, us, about tell us about the music. Tell us about your music. <laughs> <Is this> TMC? <laughs> <laughs> um, the new single. Who cares about this? No one cares about yeah. this single. Well, honestly, here's what I found was interesting. You made like a dirty version, and then you had to clean up, clean it up. Which one you like better, the dirty no, version? No, the or? dirty version was the original. You know what? It okay. came up where I, I didn't sing the song because of shock. Uh, yeah, I didn't think I was gonna shock people with it. Come on, nowadays the F word, it's not like a big. Yeah, yeah. 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 Actually, you know? we were just talking about that a little while ago. Like it doesn't really matter. Yeah, like the matter. new I was Rihanna song is all about it, giving it tonight. Head. But the bosses. <laughs> Or tell me, you know what, it's no. better not. There's kids, and I understand. I completely understand. But he's under 18. Technically, you've never heard the F word, right? Right. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> right, right, right. But uh, that was it. That's really, truly the original one. But I, I, I sang it because I love the song. I think it's cool. I think it's, I think it's club. I think it's got a little bit of that Euro flavor that I love. Um, and I just love the melody. And you know, some songs are supposed to be taken seriously, and some songs are not supposed to be taken that serious. This is one of them. I like it as one of them too. They're just party songs. We well, get supposed no, to be fun. I have a, a uh, friend. She's Latina. She gets very mad about Latina how, from where? Latina shit from uh, Mexico. Mexico. And she gets very mad about the whole like cheating on your girlfriend, you know all that stuff. It's a and, song. Wait, but I, and then she's dancing around my house singing that song, and I'm like, Have you listened to the lyrics? And what'd she <laughs> say? It's in Clique. <laughs> it's because <laughs> it's, no, it's, 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 it's okay. A, it's it's supposed to be fun, right? I, yeah, yeah, I wrote that song. You know, some songs are supposed to be fantasy. Some songs are supposed to be a little more honest, a little more truthful. This one's 100% honest. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Not, I'm kidding not, not, not. Really? Is that this one's just supposed to be fun. Not, it's a fun song. It's been a little while since you toured in the States, right? I saw you, guy, I think it's eight years ago. Shit, yeah, know. you had the police called on me a couple times. No, but it's been a while. Is it good to be back? Uh, were you the guy that was running around naked? <laughs> in Dallas. That was in Grand come Prairie. Up for a hero? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I remember you. <laughs> I remember you. No, what's it like You're to be talented. back touring? Thank you. I appreciate that. I, I'm not even going to say it. Is it? Um, <laughs> I'll show you how talented is, I am. <laughs> is it tougher to be. <laughs> Oh, back to the music. <laughs> what are you All guys right. on? Yeah, back to the music. <laughs> anyway, nothing. Oh. This is me every day. All right, we're, we're getting a wrap-up signal, and we liar. don't want to wrap it up. We really don't, but we're going to have to. <laughs> All right, Enrique Iglesias, thank you so much. Hopefully, I'll see you guys next time in Sitges. <laughs> you'll see yeah, us every you'll time. See me there. And I'm glad you I'm waiting there for you right Anywhere now. you invite us, we'll be there. Oh, no, just one. No, no, no. Me and Derek oh. went. Oh, okay. You and Derek. Yeah. yeah. We're not a couple. Okay. Just because we're gay doesn't mean we're together. No, I didn't say no. I know you guys, Derek. <laughs> so what happened? I mean, what happens when you go to a place like Sitges and you see a lot of men and you're with Derek? Slip him a roofie. What are you talking about? <laughs> he loses you Derek. You put him to sleep. I get rid of him. <laughs> I can make sure he's strong. Okay. Okay. Yeah, come on, Enrique. All right. We do have to rub it up. Enrique Iglesias, everybody, with Fernando and Greg backstage at the Triple Ho Show on 99.7.